Hello, Hitman fans! There are 18 disguises available in Santa Fortuna. Let's go get them! Our first disguise is the Shaman. We go to his hut. How is it going? Why does to talk to the shaman so urgent? Why doesn't she just get him herself? She's got a lot on her mind. Near the door to the hut, there is an urn. Inside the urn, the key to the hut. Shoot the urn. Take the key and open the door. Turn off the radio to lure the shaman inside. Turn it back on. We don't want anyone else coming in. Close the door and subdue him. Shaman disguise acquired. 17 more disguises to go. I'm going to assassinate Senor Franco with the cocaine machine. I need the circuit board. Now we go to the coca fields. Wait here a few seconds until these two go away. Disguise number two, Kuka Field Guard. Throw a coin to distract one of these two guards. Don't run. If you run, you're going to make noise. Let's drag him a bit further away. If we leave the body here, he's going to be found. That's enough. Undress him. For our next disguise, we go all the way to the helicopter. Make sure no one is looking this way and subdue him. Drag him a bit to make sure he is hidden by the coca plants. Now we go towards the production shed where the cocaine machine is. I'll take these coins. I'm going to need a lot of coins during this run. Turn off the generator. A drug lab worker will come to turn it back on. We stay hidden until he comes. In the crate he goes. Now I'm going to insert the circuit board into the cocaine machine. All we have to do now is wait. Jorge Franco will come and he will dismiss all the workers. When he is alone, we'll feed him to the machine. Deus mio. It's... It's perfect. Franco confirmed down. Nice work, 47. Next, the submarine crew disguise. We infiltrate the caves. 
Wait, there is a camera here. Before turning on the toy, look around to see if the patrolling elite guard is near. If he is, wait. You don't want him to be the one distracted by the toy. Oh, great. Now we infiltrate the mansion. Next, the chef disguise. Follow me. Don't mind the NPCs looking at you, just run inside this bathroom. Turn on the faucet to lure one of the two maids from the adjacent room here. We have to distract the other maid. Throw a coin. The chef disguise is here. I'm getting kind of scared here. Now we run towards the wine cellar. There we'll find a member of the mansion staff and we're going to undress him. There is a crate nearby. This crowbar will prove useful later. Now I'm going to assassinate Rico Delgado. We go to Hector's room. Every few minutes, Rico goes there to talk to his brother. We have to distract Hector. We go to the bathroom and overflow the sink. I'll use this barber razor to, um, shave Rico. Place a coin here behind the couch. Rico will come, he will see the coin and he will go to it. Behind the couch is where Rico will die. Hector will never find the body because he never looks behind the couch when searching for his letter. Rico Delgado has been eliminated. Nicely done. Next, Dan Buckman. We go towards the hippo enclosure. Wait, there he is. He's going to go into the bushes and check his phone. Let's go. Keep your head down and don't run. You leaving? So the hippos are mad, okay? There's nothing left to do here. To the construction site we go. There is a flower here with emetic properties. I'll need an emetic in about two minutes. Next, the street soldier disguise. Make yourself visible to lure the soldier. Throw a coin to make the construction worker go near the dumpster. The street soldier comes here searching for you. Subdue his ass. Next, the construction worker. We send him near the dumpster and that's where we find him. Disguise number 11 can be found on the other side of the river. Shoot the wooden post to release the log. The massive tree trunk will rotate and connect the two sides of the river, creating a bridge. A dead mansion guard can be found here. Take his clothes.
Now we go to the bar to acquire this guy's number 12, the bartender. Tamper with the fuse box to lure the bartender. Now hide. In the dumpster he goes. We poison P Power's beer. If you remember, I picked a flower with emetic properties near the construction site. You can never have too many coins. Now we go to the bathroom and wait for P Power. Wait for the door to close and. Now we go to the submarine engineer's house to acquire two disguises, elite guard and, of course, submarine engineer. My husband nearly lost his arm when that winch broke, but I think he's on the In here we find two more coins. We throw one of them near the dumpster. The elite guard goes to it. Now we acquire the submarine engineer outfit. Throw a coin to distract the engineer. Damn. Who is breaking the staff? Hello? Who made that sound? When I came here, I triggered the engineer's wife routine and she's on her way home. I have to be careful and avoid her. I have a feeling she knows what her husband looks like. Next, the drummer disguise. We go to his house. The drummer has a roommate. We have to get rid of the roommate. Turn off the fuse box. Wait here until the roommate exits. The door will remain open after he leaves. That's when we enter the house. Now I'm going to assassinate Andrea Martinez. I'll jump over the wall and infiltrate her office. Shoot the camera. Let's go upstairs. Glue yourself to the wall here and open the doors. Wait for Paula to go to Andrea's desk and shoot the surveillance recorder. The bullet impact was noticed. Panicked, Andrea runs to the balcony. All targets neutralized. This should paralyze the cartel. Excellent work, 47. Now head for an exit. I want to know if I discovered all the areas in Santa Fortuna. To see the map, press M. Well, what do you know? The only unexplored area is Andrea's meeting room. Next, the hippie disguise. We go to the hostel. Gosh darn it. Hey, what's up, man? Sit down. 
Using the crowbar I took from the basement of Rico Delgado's mansion, I gain access to the room. Turn on the alarm clock. The hippie is distracted. Turn off the alarm clock. Close the door and knock him out. Let's get out of here. The last disguise is the gardener. We go to the pink house near Andrea's office. Inside the house, we'll find the gardener and his wife. Drop all your coins here except one. We throw the last coin to make the man come outside. While he's out, we put our hands on his wife. Not in a disrespectful manner, mind you. We just strangle her half to death. In the crate she goes. Don't worry about her husband, he's still outside gathering coins. There it is, the last disguise. Now I say goodbye, and until next time, try not to choke the ladies unless you have their consent.